you want to deal with them. And then you'll probably just wait, train, and after that, until the time comes, if you are truly truthful about your willingness to seal the other you, after after the thing is done, you will put yourself in a special confinement made by us and wait until we prepare ritual and summon perhaps summon somebody or something that will be able to purify you or just seal that part one of your soul. If the and war starts, you let me out. And as Marius, like now, you are as you. After you did, you are not in no position to make uh, make demands. We are fully aware of the magnitude of the situation, and we know what is at stake. We will let you out when you will be ready. Hopefully, in the like, we still have few months. We'll be able to pour enough power to the uh, flying uh, to the legion that he will be able to summon servant powerful enough to completely purify you. Sir Marwar down. Well, he is a deity. He has. Paladin and Oracle powers, but he was always mostly a warrior, not a healer. So we'll probably have to find somebody else. But yeah, that... I really wouldn't call it a deal. Hmm. Well, I'm going to assume it's either that or you find your whatever way of slaughtering me, if I'm correct. Or permanently sealing you. So I will accept. Just give me about a week to prepare. You can even watch me the entire time. A week or two we have. There's just apart from preparation there's still a thing that will require of you and the others, assuming they will be eager to complete that task. Yeah, basically you... Uh, this happened way too many times and you... What's the word in English? Their trust in you is kinda... All time gone really. out. Nothing. Not shattered, but yeah, it's... You have to build it up again. So there is only their goodwill and realization that there is a lot at stake here that they immediately doesn't... They, that they welcomed you like that and not by blasting 10 different spells on your face. Yes, that would be painful. Yes, considering as Marius disease, yes. Sounds sexual. <laughs> oh my. That might be entertaining. Motherfucking Freudian slips. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, as once again, sometime later, as you are flying back is to the city, powerful spells. Yeah, again here, like probably at some point, you return to your room, or other wait, I will ask it otherwise. Uh, after like everything calms down, you explain the situation with Alti, you like settle down with like loot and whatnot. Do you seek out Ramus? Uh, I probably should. <laughs> yes, you probably should. But are you? Mm. Yes. Okay. So. Oh, I'm way too tired for this. <laughs> surprisingly enough, uh, as you look look for her. Uh, you find her in your room. You see her sitting uh, at the like at the uh, on top of the chair at the like table in your room. You see her like she's not looking like angry, just sad, like very sad and like not confused. Uh, fuck the words in English, like that you. Melancholy. 
that you let down her, that you let her down. Bet that betrayed. Slightly betrayed, sad, uh, also. Fuck, like other words. Yeah, something like that. General mood is like that. And you see, like, she's like, you know, doing the. Uh, like, waiting. Signal, like, putting striking fingers on the table. And right next to her hand, you see. Fuck. I hope I didn't fuck it up and don't doesn't reckon it. But next to her hand, uh, you see the wedding ring that you gave her. And uh, she's not really say saying anything. She's just like looking at you expectantly. Well, suppose this is as good of time as any. As I uh, say it, and I move to uh, uh, sit uh, on the opposite side of her. And uh, hopefully, not uh, John and Jaya isn't outside of the door listening in. I bet you they are. Entire group is just listening outside listening. the door. I mean, for real, for serious, I would assume that would be kind of private moment. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I'm not even there. No. The no, thing he, with he... Asmarius was just for funsies, but it's not like I'm listening to everything. Yeah, yeah. that it was fun. Okay. Right. So yeah, she's like, like, not slowly. I'm. I'm listening. I won't apologize for what I did. No, just that uh, I did it for our safety. The fact that you weren't there alone wasn't very safe to begin with. <laughs> Why, like she says to her, why you didn't trust it us? Why you didn't trust it me? Why you didn't say anything? <sighs> I don't know where, uh, what the uh, variant told you, but the troop knew how to get inside of the uh, uh, castle unnoticed and leave me a message just knowing that meant that uh, beating them took a highest priority for me I understand that I mean, one part wants to understand the second. I mean, she points at the ring. That should have meant something. It, I I thought that you wanted us to like be together, like not hold secrets or don't leave one another in the dark. I mean, what would have happened if you had failed? If the others, if Alti didn't like connected the dots, and like I might have lost you. Uh, that was a possibility I didn't take into consideration. I hoped since uh, the leader called me out to a duel that I could finally beat him and this and quickly teleport out before they were any of the wiser. She's like things very hard for him. And 
her expression didn't change much. Like, although it may be slightly less of like sadness, but there is still like a tinge of like that she still feels a little bit betrayed. And she's. Well, can you promise me that this entire thing with the Phantom Poop is now completely gone in the past and we can all forget about it? That you won't, in the first of revenge, go blindly to maybe to your death or not, but you won't risk it again like that. Uh, Genko kind of looks down uh, at the, the table and uh, kind of uh, waits for a uh, about 10 seconds before looking up at Ramus and uh, nodding. Seeing how uh, there may be some uh, stragglers left from the original troop, but I'm not sure if they have the power uh, or will to uh, seek out revenge, or if it's even in their nature. Well, even if they come back, remember, <sighs> now we are not alone and we're gonna face this together as we should have. And with that, like, she takes the ring and puts it again on her, uh, on, her on her finger. Thanks, John. Uh, and but she's like, uh, like she's still sad, but like she tries to cheer up the situation, and there's like a. Not really forced, but really small smile. That, well, remember that, Genkiro? We are women. We might forgive, but we never. <laughs> I. Well, I still want to spend the rest of the life with you, but I will need some time to, like, really think hard about it and like she speaks <laughs> you realize that this is her way of like without saying it directly that <laughs> don't, don't expect any like uh, nighttime activities for the upcoming like tour <laughs> for once you're not fucked <sighs> and uh And the Genkiro kind of uh, smiles back at her. It wasn't uh, for that reason that I chose you to live with. <laughs> oh, shit. And, like, because that was in your room, like, uh, as she exits, uh, she gives you a kiss on the lips. And as she, like, I know I am, after all, women of many talents. And as she's exiting, she, like, sways her hips. And like, then she backs up for us. And well, for now I'm leaving it up to you when you want to say to others and like, yeah, remember, try to set the wedding day. Because you have that to do that. I, I, I kind of want a wedding before the apocalypse strike. And with that. Yeah. <laughs> So I'll guys, speak to Varian about it. So, after messing with Martin a bunch, I have just shy of 4,000 gold. Okay, please do tell what you... I, I, I'm getting to that now. I In fact, almost... write, write it up on the chat. Yeah, I, I am. I'm, I'm going to make a list in Notepad and then write it up on the chat. But basically, you will look something like Archer? Um, I, I have 
uh, magic cans that let me store weapons. <laughs> that's <laughs> Motherfucker! <laughs> yup. <laughs> I mean, that's either, yeah, Unlimited Blade Wars or Gate of Babylon. No, uh, mm. that is actually just the one that he has. I'd say that's just his tracing ability. Mm. Oh yeah, yeah, I that's the gloves, then that will be... But I, can, but I can store, like, all of the weapons that we've gotten so far, just like, hey, y'all. Now, if it's legitimately, like, if it's all about the Unlimited Blade Works stuff, it's a shit ton of floating weapons around you. Mm. <laughs> yeah, it kinda is, but it's about us. Yup. Mm. Okay, uh... So wait, I did that... Fuck, for a moment I just completely lost... I suggest everyone getting a mantle of spell resistance, because... Jai can craft it for 45,000 and it's 21. Which is... Pretty decent. Yeah, instead of deciding what scenes I wanna take... There's like... Let's say... You return to the city, I'm not deciding like what day is it... Because I'm guessing like the... Uh, crafting, buying, selling takes at least two or three, I mean, week or two. Crafting takes a while. Yeah, so yeah. as it takes a while, like, you are back at the Dragon Hide city. Is there anything specific that your characters want to do? And, and I'm gonna start asking that uh, for uh, John and Aoti, because they didn't really have that much of the screen time. John Stevenson. Uh, <clears throat> just in terms of downtime stuff he uh someone said that they were, can make a mantle of SR yep that's me I just rolled I'll take, uh, I'll, checks. Take, I'll take one of those okay as long as I didn't roll a one I was fine I didn't roll a one so I'm fine okay so mm. let's put what what is the uh, full title title mantle of spell resistance also, um, lots of people forget it. Um, there's some stuff. There's books and tomes which can give you permanent increases to stats. Yeah. Which are great. Yeah, how much do they cost again? Let me ask you. Um, depending on what your stat is, mine are even, so I just went with, went with the plus four. If there's are odd, you can go for the plus five. Uh, mm -hmm. Plus four is a hundred and ten thousand. Plus five is a hundred and thirty-seven thousand and five hundred gold. Yep. So they're mm -hmm. expensive, but they're really good. Yep. <sighs> Manual of quickness of action would probably be good for me. Um, now, if I make them, because I can mm -hmm. make them, it will have a chance of failure. Um, and that still costs money. Yeah, it still mm -hmm. costs money. As happened with, um, as happened with. Uh, with our with our good friend uh, Endith, who I rolled a one for on his uh, manual for better intelligence. <laughs> was, that intelli was that intelligence? That was intelligence. Yeah. Oh, I I meant to do the wisdom one. Oh, mm. okay. Well, that's fine. <laughs> you because the costs are the Jewish. same. Yeah, it, it's all the same. But I I thought that was the wisdom one. So you weren't wise enough to choose the right one. It seems. Yep. Or I wasn't but intelligent enough to choose the right one. If you guys, if you guys, ugh, if you guys want one, just tell me and I'll make it for you. Yeah, I would want the what's the name again? Yeah, of action. Just, just send a link. They're I just, just need to you. roll a three or higher. So, mm. but there is a chance of failure. Manual of quickness of action, four plus four. Dring. Okay. <laughs> Find it. I didn't expect it to do that, but there you go. Yeah, it's a DC of 22, so. Yep, we're fine. Mm. Okay, so just write it up on me. And I, I'm spending these weeks up to my isolation reading those books. Yeah, yeah, before you go to the isolation, like, there will be st uh, still a matter or two that... The variant is my There was still some stuff we had to do, right? Mm. Yeah, once or two that I can think of. Right? Which one is kind of more important than the second, but you technically have the time to do them both. Uh, my AC is climbing. <laughs> What's your AC? 
Yeah, I get bonuses to AC both from Wisdom and Dexterity. Oh, nice. As do I. What's your <laughs> AC? Uh, AC, I haven't quite fixed it yet, but it's about 40. Right? <laughs> I, have, mm. I haven't increased my, uh, from my will bonus, but right now I'm sitting at 39. Mm. Nice. <laughs> Nicely done. <sighs> Gotta go in the toilet. How did both of you get uh, Wisdom from, uh, for AC? As you can already, like, we, we have the same tokens. Class. Oh, that helps. Here be. Yeah. I know of uh, like an oracle way to do it where you get your um what you call it to AC. I need to adjust my health to Ego's uh AC currently is forty five in combat, it goes up to forty seven. Yeah. That's why I put you on that page so we can edit your tokens. Yeah. And oh by the way, um if it would be great if during combat and we're being swarmed or something of that nature, if you guys stay close to me, because if you do, if you are within my reach, which is I have a maximum of 25 foot reach, so if you're within 25 feet of me, you gain 20, uh, you gain 4 AC and plus 4 bonus to saves. My bonus to hit with my katanas is currently my highest is plus... 31. Nice. Nice. My okay. highest to hit would be plus 24. Nice. But you, you hit like touch, right? Half no. of the time? That, that's already that does. Yeah. All right. I did, I did get that fancy mask, which does as much as one of my <clears throat> other abilities. Yeah, I'm probably going to need uh, some uh, gear to make me attack uh, touch AC instead of normal AC. Sadly, there is no real way to do uh, that. I know that for the weapons you can take... No, wait, I'd... even Brilliant Energy doesn't directly yeah. attack touch AC. Brilliant Energy does. It allows you to attack... Um, Brilliant more. Energy ignores armor. Yeah, problem is... You're practically useless against constructs. And undead. Yep. Oh, so, for undead, I have uh, the Starbow, which does 10d8 damage. Nice. That's pretty good. <laughs> I forgot you had a bow. It's, it's, it's good to have Say. another bowman. <clears throat> What's everyone's health at, by the way? Um, I have to recalculate mine since I increased my constitution. Oh. But yeah. right now it's 257. Nice. 209. Mm -hmm. okay. Helps least... that one of these things I got increases my size and my katanas have impact. At least my um at least my title as 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 tank still stands. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wait, are you 10 by 10? And Ew. No, um I I have some shoulders. That I can increase my size on command. Ah, okay. Yeah, three times a day, right? No, that, that's. I can activate the Deadly Juggernaut spell three times a day after killing someone yeah. for one minute. And I that's also good. get the Ferocity ability, which. Um, I can. which gives me. Uh, Die hard, pretty much. I can Juggernaut cauldrons. I might actually give that to Ego, as well, because that's really good, and that will up his uh, size to gargantuan. Does he count as a humanoid? Yes, he does. Okay, Let's... as far as I'm aware. Uh, yeah, he still does, just barely count as a humanoid, but yeah. <laughs> okay, just just making sure. Yeah. Uh, by the it's, way, it's... Matt, yes. could you increase my token by a size step? Oh, no. Sweet Thank Jesus, you. how big are you now? I am... Uh, I am colossal. 
Yeah, at that point, uh, unless he's in human form, he will be getting troubles in getting some parts of the Definitely, legion. Definitely, yeah. Because it's big, but it's not that big. I mean, it, it wasn't built for for creatures that big. Oh, I was saying that. Yeah. And I've still got my dark sight goggles. Yeah, Alvith probably looks at Jai even more as his uh, senpai. <laughs>